Hey guys, and uh, welcome to another uh, Blu-ray and DVD update video. And uh, if you've seen uh, the recent shots I've done, uh, I talked about how you know a while ago, you know, they shut, they unfortunately shut down like the HMV uh, that's that I usually went to. Um, and uh, you know, um, they're they're opening, they're bringing back a HMV to my area um, at the end of November, which is very cool. But I was able to um, travel to another um, HMV, and uh, which was great. Um, and uh, I really missed going to one of them. And I was able to pick up some of the uh, premium titles that they had there. Um, I really do like the HMV premium uh, releases. And you know, I did get some of the premium releases at um, you know the HMV I used to go to before they shut it down. So yeah, I am glad there bringing back one more local one but I am glad as well uh, I was very happy to be able to have traveled to that other HMV uh, so yeah and uh, I also um, while I was there where I traveled to they also had um, a CEX and I was able to get one DVD from the CEX there so I've got one DVD and uh, three Blu-rays and all the Blu-rays are um hmv premium blu-rays Blu so uh, first of all i'll show you the the dvd that i got at uh, cx which is click um now you might remember a while ago i'd picked up this um so yeah, i got this at a um i got this at a uh, charity shop in the uk but i didn't realize until i got home that it was an american uh, dvd and it's region one so it doesn't work in my player which is annoying, but I'm glad I was able to get um, a UK copy of it. Um, I tried selling this to a CEX, but they, they wouldn't take it because uh, it's an American disc and they can't sell like foreign discs, um, even though I bought this at a charity shop in the UK. But I'm um, yeah, glad to have this. Uh, very funny movie you know, where, where Adam Sandler has like a remote control basically where he can like control the world and it's very funny but then it gets quite emotional when it basically ruins his life but you know I like the stuff like when he pauses time and like you know slaps uh, David Hasselhoff across the face so yeah crackling comedy duck treat uh, yeah I would agree with that so yeah now I'll show you the premium titles I'll show them in the order of their like spine numbers. So first one I'll show is a uh, Grand Prix uh, in the premium collection. It's uh, in, it's from 1966 and it's number 64 in the collection. So yeah, this is a really good movie. I I, I enjoyed this a lot. Um, all about racing in the Grand Prix. And the racing was all very. Uh, fascinating. Uh, it was very well filmed, and you know, I enjoyed the talking about the racing as well. You know, and all that. Kind of a cool picture on the back of that. But um, yeah, it's starring of course like uh, James Garner, and uh, and it's got a guy in it, Brian Bedford. I know him from. Um, he was also the voice of Robin Hood in the Disney. Robin Hood, you know, the one where they're all animals, uh, where Robin Hood is a fox. He is uh, the voice of Robin Hood in that. And, yeah, you get to see him in this. It's also got, like, uh, Adolfo Chili, who I know is, like, Largo in the James Bond film Thunderball. So, yeah, a very good film. I first heard of this sort of... Um, there's a review I watch, uh, R&B Reviews. I'll put a link to his review of this film in the description. But, yeah, I was interested from that review... And then I found out it's in the premium collection, so I picked up this edition. Yeah, really did uh, enjoy this film a lot. So, yeah. Uh, next, I'll show uh, this one, uh, Mighty Joe Young. This is uh, from 1949, and it's number 77 in the collection. And it's basically, you know, it's got, a, a, you know, connections to King Kong, basically, you know... Um, because it's about a gorilla, and the gorilla's done with stop motion, and also it's made by the makers of King Kong, you know, um, uh, Ernest B. Schroesbach, however you say it, and uh, 
Marion C. Cooper also worked on it, and they made King Kong. And it's also got uh, Robert Armstrong in this, who was also in King Kong. Yeah, and they also released the original King Kong in the premium collection as well, and I do have that as well. So um, I was happy to get this in. Yeah, really did uh, enjoy this film. Yeah, I think if you like King Kong, you'll probably like this. Yeah, and I know the stop motion in this was also done by um, Ray Harryhausen, who um, has done a lot of work on films with like stop motion in them. Like uh, he's worked on like um, like Attack like Attack of the Titans and uh, like Jason and the Argonauts and stuff like that. Um, and the original King Kong was, um, I think, was a big influence for him. Um, and uh, so it was cool that he got to work with the makers of King Kong on this movie. So, yeah. so like inside it, I've got the disc in the player now. I've been watching it. But uh, it's got like a poster in it. I guess I could hang that up. And also like great like art cards that they come with in the premium collection. Uh, if I open that up, there's a great picture on the back. Yeah, that's very cool. The people have in the tug of war fight with uh, Mighty Joe Young. So yeah, uh, there was like a Disney remake of this. I mean, th yeah, this one's not by Disney, but Disney did like a remake of this in the 90s. But um, I imagine this is probably the much better version. So yeah. Next, I'll show uh, Top Gun, uh, the original. I know like there's a new one that's come out. I uh, haven't seen the new one yet. The new one's yeah, it's supposed to be really good, but um, this is a cool movie. So it's from uh, 1986, and it's number 115 in the collection. So, yeah. And... Yeah, very cool picture. It's a very cool uh, movie, you know, with Tom Cruise and, like, Val Kilmer and stuff. Yeah. Uh, I look forward to seeing the second one. Many people... Many people say the second one's even better, but I'll just see. This cool artwork, and it comes with art cards here, and it does come with a poster, which I've already hung up, so the poster's not in here. There's like the full picture on the back here, if you want to see that. And uh, I don't think I showed it with the Grand Prix one, but here's the picture on the inside of that, which is very cool. Um, and uh, of course it does also come with uh, the art cards, which I've still got in here, I'll open it up another time. So yeah, hope you enjoyed uh, this pickup. I'll look forward to when they opened up the local HMV, but I was glad to travel to this other one and pick up these premium titles because I do really like these premium titles and I've missed, you know, picking up and I miss going there in general. You know, even apart from the premium editions, that they have a lot of other cool stuff there. So yeah, thanks for watching this video. Hope you enjoyed and uh, bye.